Um. It's one that has to do with me fighting Jiraiya, and it does this thing that's never been said before in any of the other games, and it's really annoying because I don't know what to do and how to complete the mission. And I wanted to ask you guys for help. Anyway, danger, mushroom soup. In front of the academy. Choji Hachimiki. I was thinking of making some mushroom soup. Do you want some? It's a special Akamichi clan recipe. You know it's gonna be good. Find the missing items, pick the most appropriate choice, finish the battle should it occur. Um... In short, if you give him the wrong mushroom, it changes shit. It's probably him being poisoned or something. I think you failed too, but I'm not sure. Alright, then let's do this. Wait, wait, let's get some scrolls while we're at it. Why not? This map really fucking confuses me, I tell you what. I mean, it's nice to still have the map and be told where everything is. Not gonna lie, I have tried constantly to get a lot of these in one go. I am that much of a nerd of this game. It's a fun game, though. I, I, when I'm in a bad mood, it's really this is really something that helps put me in a good place. All the scrolls! Yay, I got a lot. Again, I'm, again, farming scrolls later on to help with shit. And yeah, if, in case you want a little bit extra of a push, you can kick, too. That's what I like to do anyway. Are you here for mushroom soup too? Yum. This is the Akamichi clan recipe for mushroom soup. It's great, I guarantee it. But there's no such thing as a free lunch. Hey, that's true in every forms. In case any of you guys know that it's the ideal of economics. Whoever wants some has to bring a mushroom. That's the rule. Got that? So go find yourself a mushroom. Yay! So yeah, I love how the game shows where the mushrooms are. There's only one. That scares me. You're looking for a mushroom? Just make sure to avoid anything with purple and red spots. Those are poisons. But the training field has some taste. Po uh, purple or red dots. Let's keep that in mind. Good to know. So in short, if you give him the wrong one, he gets pissed off. Add to debt. Not yet. I want to look around. There's no way this is the end of the mission. Alright then, there's this. How do you fuck up? What if I go to the Hidden Leaf Forest? And there's nothing in here, either that or there was, but it got turned off. I'm positive this blue spots is probably gonna make us fucking... Make him, like, slow or something or pissed off. What are you gonna do? Whee! And short, if it's the wrong one, he attacks. Mm, that was delicious. I don't know who does Choji, but that's awesome. That's awesome voice. Are you planning on hogging it all to yourself? Thanks for the great mushroom. Here's something in return. Yay, energy pills. Wow, that was easy as shit. I think I've actually actually gone back to get him the wrong one just for fun. True Hidden Lotus. I forgot what happens. All I remember is that he gets pissed off. Yay, more level ups for Gara. Gonna try using him as much as possible. What the hell's Resist do? Oh, I forgot. That's for Chakra. Yeah. So yeah, I didn't really explain this, like, but I guess I should. Uh, attack is obviously your physical attack. Defense is physical defense. Speed is obviously speed. Tools is how many tools you have in the beginning of battle. And chakra is uh, your jutsus and I believe your secret techniques. Not sure about the secret techniques part. Secret techniques might be set number of damage. And then there's resist which either resists just jutsu or jutsu and secret techniques. So there you go. Not that hard to figure out on yourself. All the jutsu! Sorry, all the level ups. 
Didn't we just get Nightmare 2? When I say that, I literally mean didn't we just get Nightmare 2? What are you gonna do? Yeah, sorry, I didn't mean to skip that. Alright then. Almost done with the missions here. <laughs> only I'm only in like 30 minutes. Lovely. And we're in the last mission. Secret mission. Ooh, thousand Rio. Nice. Round Shikamaru special seat. Secret mission 1010. I think Nanty will be even stronger if he learns how to use ninja tools perfectly too. I wouldn't mind teaching him, but he has too much pride. He refuses to learn. Can you take my place and show Neji how important ninja tools are, are while training? Oh, okay. This is gonna be fucking easy. So, in short, um... God, how many items do I have? I don't know. I'm gonna go buy, like, a few more of, uh... Ninja tool stuff. Because it's just gonna be using different kinds of ninja tools in battle. I want to be ready for that shit. Welcome. What do you need? Uh... One. Ooh, this is a good idea. I'm actually gonna buy a lot of spikes. I love the spikes tool. It's one of my favorite. Uh, I also like the shurikens. Awesome. And that's all I'll keep for now. Sweet. So there we go. All the items. Now we're gonna go uh, fight Neji. Woohoo. How are we gonna do that? I don't. I might. I don't know if I want to use 1010 or not. I thought it. Oh, it's near his special spot. Shigamaru's, that is, because that's where it's supposed to be. Nope. Yeah, that won't bore him to death. Love climbing on the walls, it's so much fun. No, I wanted that. No, you get over here, big scroll. You're a mine. I want that big scroll, damn it. Oh, I almost had it. How did I miss that? Get over here. No. You guys are probably laughing at me right now. <laughs> Michael can't get the scroll. Bitch just got it. Fuck you. So, yeah. Whatever, anyway, since we got a lot of money, I want to buy this right now. Why not? Perfumes. Oh, it's an accessory set. Oh, I get it. So we buy it once and then we're done. We can give him a bunch. Okay, that makes sense. Effort omelet set, victory amulet set. You give these to the guys for their quote-unquote dates. Training shuriken bundle. I have no idea what that is. Training shuriken knife, or kunai knife bundle. New scroll set. I like this. You only have to buy one and you're done. Nice. So now we're done with this, so now I can randomly talk to people and hopefully get some stuff out of them. Meaning, more dates and stuff. You know. And yes, I'm still calling it date instead of something else because hell, in Final Fantasy VII, you can have a quote-unquote date with Barrette. Ho ho ho, that is fucking hilarious. Go online and look it up if you don't know what I'm talking about. And Eddie. I'll kick your ass, pal. You better walk the fuck away. Okay, so who should I use real fast while I think about that? I'm gonna text my girlfriend. Alright then, so... Uh, with this, I don't know if I want to use a tool person because, well, I already bought all the tools necessary. I've already used you two. I... Let's have some fun. We're going to use Stephen Bloom point two, uh, 2.0. So, yes. I'm still surprised Stephen Bloom voices fucking Orochimaru. So, yeah. So, if you're doing this, it's always best to use 1010, but I don't like 1010. I've already used her, so fuck that shit. Only three kinds? Wow. And I didn't even need all those. So yeah, here's Orochimaru. He is pretty powerful. So... Yeah, he does seem pretty powerful. I don't really use him often, because I don't really like his character. But uh, he seems pretty powerful, though, in this game. 
Seriously, goddamn. Oh, then again, he is at a high level, I forgot. That's why. Something always to keep in mind. I did that on purpose. More oil! Okay, I, I didn't know if he was gonna pull a, a rock leaf from the last game where he runs right into the fucking damage. Oh, that was hilarious. Oh, I still need I still need to use stuff. That's the snake sword sky blade, and the other one I believe is no. No, I'm trying to do it. Get away! I don't want to kill you. Okay, so yeah, tongue suck it. That's when you actually absorb people's um, HP. Really fucked up. He said hell! Oh my god! Someone raise up the ratings for this game! It's useless. God, you're creepy, Bloom. I still want to marry you, though. Anyway, um... So, yeah, in case you didn't know, that was the point when... When they were in the, um, god damn it, what was it? They were in the Forest of Death, and they were fighting Orochimaru. Sasuke couldn't move, had to stab himself to do it. Yeah, that was easy. I never thought you could do so well with nothing but ninja tools. I hit you with more than just ninja tools. Then again, if we could only use ninja tools, oh, that would suck. I may have to reconsider the value of ninja tools. You did it! You did it! Neji must have recognized how important ninja tools are thanks to you. I appreciate your help. Take this and record. Yay, spikes! Love the spikes. I just, I really like the spikes. They're awesome weapons. And of course, we get tons of level ups now. Ooh, Blazing Rasan. Oh, that is the Nine Tails Rasan gun. We probably need Scroll One and two Water Balloons for that one. Curse Mark Chidori, okay. <laughs> they get it at the same time, nice. Their Jutsus along with their special stuff. Well, that was pretty easy, and I believe that was the last mission. Ooh, there's one more, huh. Next secret mission, ooh, in front of Sashu. Ooh, Neji Huega. <laughs> it was obvious that Ten Ten sent you to do that training the other day, but I'll admit it was quite helpful. In exchange, I want you to teach Ten Ten the effectiveness of close quarter combat without the use of tools. Be sure to keep it a secret. Sure that works. Ooh, payback. I love when I love when the missions add on to each other, in short, you think that there's only one mission and then they add another one. Kind of like in the first game when it was something about guys training. There was like a there was like a part two to it. Yeah. Were you the one who asked the mission? Is um no. It's obvious Ten Ten's behind this. I have a little advice for her in return. A long range attacker like her needs to understand the effectiveness of close combat. Especially in this game, ninja tools kind of, well, you can't really just use ninja tools. Alright then, let's do this. Boom. Shaka laka laka. Anyway, sorry, I mean, weird. So, Ten Ten, gonna beat the crap out of you too. Cause that's what I do. Death to all who oppose me. And I cannot pay attention to what the. Right here, okay. Shut up and just do it. Well, let's get started then. All the cool kids are training with each other. Are you cool, Ten Ten? Are you cool? I don't think she's cool, guys. All right, then who to use now? Probably something that has to do with consecutive attacks. So, yeah, <laughs> let's use Neji. I need to check to see what he has though. That storm dance is what I want. Uh, I need other stuff. Uh, fuck you, game. Alright, I'm good. I wish I had other stuff, though. Really did. But, because I, you have to buy it. That, that's the only problem with this, for me, right now, is I have to buy everything, which is why I'm gonna do a lot of training off-screen. 15 consecutive attacks, obviously. <laughs> we did it at the same time. 
We we got it. So 21 consecutive attacks, even though he hits our 22 times. Fucking game. So yeah. So there's points where you need a lot more, and as I've said, Naruto is your best choice, especially if he's leveled up. Bitch. Let's bring it on. He's actually pulling herself pretty well. What's the matter, girl? Huh? Huh? You scared? Rotation. Did you think you'd won? Maybe. And just to fuck with you. <laughs> wow, right in the ass. <laughs> That's kind of mean, Nechi. <laughs> that was really funny. Yeah, I can't hit me, sorry. Oh come on, you were close. She hit me up close with fucking tool. You dare poison the great Neji. This is actually a really fun battle. You know, quick question. How many of the points are near the upper area? Is he gonna pull a Shikamaru? There! Sorry, I feel like copying a field. I mean, seriously. Everyone asks those fucking questions. Don't lie, people. Do not lie. If you lie to me, I swear to fucking God, I'll beat the crap out of all of you. That's right, I'm an abusive person. Deal with it. Phew. That's enough for today. By the way, I'm surprised you did so well without using any tools. I don't know who taught you how to fight like that, but give them my compliments. <laughs> I love using characters that are supposed to be hiding. That's cool. Awesome! And now we go through the roll of experience, so yes, I don't know what to do next now. I got about 40 minutes in, so... That's enough for this episode. I do, Like I said, I want to do some grinding before I do too much else. In the next episode, I'll be doing... I mean, if I get anything else on the G2 thing, I'll, be, I'll do it right now. But if there's anything else on the, um... Yeah, if there's anything else, I'll do that. But in the next episode, we're going to do the finals of that, and then we're going to finish up pretty much the rest of the game with B and A rank missions. I want to balance this out, but I don't want to do that last because it's so easy, it'll just, it'll be boring. And especially, we're only going to be using Naruto. Not only that, but we're going to get extra missions anyway after that part, so it doesn't matter. Alright then, so is there any other missions we need to do? Zero available missions, so we have six. Oh, we still have none in A, wow. Yeah, see, we couldn't do them right now. Oh, this is infamous. I remember this. Yeah, you can do random missions whenever you want. And you get money for it and stuff, Heroes Memorial Monument. Oh! We have to actually go somewhere? Oh, that's the... I can't what it's saying. So yeah, we can do this right now, why not? I'm bored, and I just want to show you guys this for a quick second. And I don't know if this is in the last game, but this pretty much allows for you to do a lot. Let's see... So yeah, we need to do 25 consecutive attacks. Sadly, Neji only does 21. A sand gun might work. I don't know about this one, but... Yeah, okay. So yeah, that should work. We'll use Crimson Chakra right now, okay. Yep. As much as Naruto gets used, it's best to use him for consecutive attacks, because he can do a lot of attacks really fast. Yeah, slow guys like Choji and whatnot, bad idea. Oh, we can't jump, I forgot about that. No, I wasn't paying attention. Got him. I don't even think I can try to counteract that thing. Let me show you what I can do. Got him. You got you, bitch. Critical damage. Uppercut. Sorry, you can. Come on, bitch, come on. Boom. This is what I was talking about, by the way, when I meant, like, the ultimate mode and stuff. This is Naruto's version of it. Where he pretty much has unlimited chakra. I go this way. Oh, I had you there. 
Don't even try to deny it. Don't jump up. <laughs> I would hate to lose now because I can't jump. Now, I don't know if it counts if one of our clones jumps. Be careful. Lol. Oh. Ow, you bitch. Ah, I forgot that thing gets rid of all your tools. No. Oh, I could have hit him there with my jutsu. So, yeah, one of our clones jumped and we seemed okay. I can't even tell if I can go on the other side of the battlefield. Gotcha. Let's see, how many hits is this? Yeah, it doesn't look like it's gonna be a lot. Yeah, only eight hits, that's not a lot. Eh. Ah, oh, you ass. That was mean. Okay, we got him. So, yes. That's infinite mission for you. You know, I kind of padded this mission out and made a perfectly timed video to be horribly timed. <laughs> but we get experience and money for it and it allows for stuff with... I'm guessing it's stuff without, like, meaning behind it. You know, they want to have something without any kind of a meaning. So, it works. That's cool. Alright then, so I do hope you guys have enjoyed this session of Naruto Ultimate Ninja 2. Uh, so yeah, that's uh, two video another two videos down for this. God, I'm getting a lot done for this. Uh, it's not that hard of a game, to be honest. Some of the later missions are going to be hard to do, I will say. But anyway, I do hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. I will uh, catch you in the next one. Save data. And I'm going to save here, because I haven't really done videos for the last one yet. Oh yeah, today's the 1st of December, wow. Yeah, you guys, I don't know if I'm able to get this to you this year. <laughs> Oh, hopefully I will, because I, I promised this uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! Capsule Monsters and Infamous. Not going to get Infamous, but hopefully I can get the other two to you guys this year. That'd be nice to fill up at least some of my schedule. I got Dark Cloud. It was it's it was the whole thing at the beginning of the year would fuck me. It fucked me over, I will admit. So I do hope you guys have enjoyed this video. I'll catch you in the next one. This is Mike June II, signing out.